Eugene de Blas, also known as Eugenio de Blas or Eugen von Blas, was a renowned Italian painter who specialized in genre and portrait painting. He was born on July 24, 1843, in Albano, near Rome, Italy, into an artistic family. His father, Karl von Blas, was a successful Austrian history painter, and his brother Julius von Blas was a well-known animal and landscape painter. The creative environment in which he grew up significantly influenced Eugene's career choice and artistic style. In his early years, Eugene received art education from his father, who was then a professor at the Academy of Rome. His father's teachings were instrumental in shaping his initial understanding of art, technique, and aesthetics. Later, he moved to Venice with his family when his father took up a position at the Venetian Academy. Here, he was exposed to the vibrant art scene of the city, which would greatly influence his future works. Venice, with its picturesque canals, beautiful architecture, and colorful inhabitants, provided a rich source of inspiration for de Blas. He developed a deep love for the city and its people, which is evident in his many paintings that depict everyday life in Venice. Unlike many of his contemporaries who focused on grand historical or mythological themes, de Blas chose to paint ordinary people going about their daily lives. This focus on genre scenes set him apart and earned him recognition and acclaim. His subjects ranged from Venetian gondoliers, fisher folk, and market vendors, to elegant ladies and courting couples. His ability to capture the spirit and character of his subjects, combined with his meticulous attention to detail and vibrant use of color, resulted in works that were both realistic and evocative. His paintings are often noted for their strong narrative element, drawing the viewer into the scene and inviting them to imagine the stories behind the characters. In addition to his genre scenes, de Blas also gained recognition as a portrait painter. His portraits are characterized by their psychological depth and sensitivity, revealing a keen understanding of human nature. He was able to capture not just the physical likeness of his subjects, but also their inner world, making his portraits compelling and lifelike. Throughout his career, de Blas exhibited his works at numerous exhibitions and galleries across Europe. His paintings were shown at the Royal Academy in London, the Munich Secession, and the Vienna Kunstlerhaus, among others. His works were well received, earning him several awards and honors. In 1886, he was appointed professor at the Venetian Academy, a position he held until his retirement in 1912. Despite his success and recognition, de Blas remained a humble and dedicated artist. He continued to live and work in Venice, finding endless inspiration in the city and its people. He painted until his final years, leaving behind a rich body of work that continues to be admired and studied today. De Blas passed away on February 10th, 1932, in Venice, leaving a lasting legacy in the world of art. His works are held in numerous public and private collections worldwide, including the Museum of Fine Arts in Boston, the Art Gallery of New South Wales in Sydney, and the National Gallery in London. Eugene de Blas' contribution to art is significant not just for his mastery of technique and his unique approach to subject matter, but also for his ability to capture the essence of a particular time and place. His paintings offer a window into the everyday life of 19th century Venice, making them valuable historical documents as well as beautiful works of art. In conclusion, Eugene de Blas was an artist who combined technical skill with a deep understanding of human nature to create works that are both visually stunning and emotionally resonant. His focus on genre scenes and portraits set him apart from many of his contemporaries and earned him a place among the most respected artists of his time. Today, his works continue to be admired for their beauty, narrative power, and historical significance.